Prince Andrew is facing challenges remaining at Royal Lodge and has explored options to pass the lease to suitable trustees like his ex-wife Sarah Ferguson or daughters Princess Beatrice and Princess Eugenie. Prince Andrew and Sarah Ferguson divorced in 1996 but continue living together at Royal Lodge, despite Andrew potentially facing eviction by King Charles. Speculation about Andrew and Sarah remarrying has occurred for years, though Sarah recently said they are happy as they are now. Royal sources say a reunion could help Andrew in his battle to stay at Royal Lodge. Andrew signed a 75-year lease for Royal Lodge in 2003 after the Queen Mother's death there in 2002. The terms allow him to bequeath the lease to immediate family, but as a divorce, renovating the 30-room mansion is difficult as its condition has declined. King Charles doubts Andrew's ability to fund estimated £2 million repairs needed inside and out, like new paint, roof fixes, as scaffolding was seen recently. As revealed earlier by the Mirror, Andrew refuses to leave and insists his lease is ironclad, exploring passing it to his daughters or a trust in their names. However, sources say Princess Beatrice and Princess Eugenie would not want the burden due to huge renovation costs. Friends say Fergie is willing to help Andrew but her money is likely tied up after a £5 million London townhouse purchase last year. One insider noted the expenses to renovate Royal Lodge and uncertainty how Andrew can afford it, making it difficult why his daughters would take on the lease instead of investing funds elsewhere without return. Andrew's finances have long been private after a $1 million settlement in the Virginia Jufri case. King Charles has threatened to remove Andrew's £4 million allowance and offered him smaller Frogmore Cottage to vacate Royal Lodge, Mirror, 2022.